Everything Something's gonna happen. I think we can just forget Something's about what happen. happened in the week. What? Duh. Hey, my name's Octa Phantom slash Octa, whichever you prefer. I see you found your way to the ghost zone. Well, today we have a special treat. Our part one of the Resident Evil playthrough. I, <coughs> I get a little scared in this for sure. But if you enjoy your stay, make sure to hit that sub button and join our community today. Well, enjoy a, well, me getting scared shitless. <laughs> also, leave a comment and a like if you'd like to see a part two of this series. All right, now to the video. Welcome everyone, welcome to the Ghost Zone. I'm your host, Sock the Phantom, as usual. And today we are playing Village, Resident Evil Village, whatever you want to call it. I'm new to this franchise and I'm scared shitless right now. I've never played one of these games and I've heard it's pretty scary and I am kind of, I'm kind of a <laughs> so <laughs> let's see how this goes, shall we? All right, all right, all right. I think, I say we just jump right into it. What do you guys think? Um, we'll hit you with all we got. No, no, no. Standard difficulty. I think, I think we should just do standard because I've never played this before. I usually am one to push it. I usually want to push it, but last time I did, that was a uh, cyberpunk, and that game was not easy. <laughs> that game was not easy. Half the people in that game were bullet sponges, so there's that. All right, let's do standard. Let's just do standard, okay? You guys might see me. You guys might see me myself during this. We'll see. We'll see how. It Long goes. ago, a young girl went with her mother to pick berries right. for her father, who was hard at work. But the forest greeted them with a dark, cold silence. The bushes empty. Yet determined to find the berries, the rascal broke free from Mother's grasp and vanished into the trees. This, this looks like the Mother's Caroline worried movie. cries faded I think it's called Caroline, the, the one with like the buttons and the dolls or whatever. Branch, and into the forest deep, feeling strange eyes upon her, the girl recalled Mother's scary bedtime tales and her throat became bone dry. All right, back to chillaxing. Then the Pat Lord appeared. He greeted her warmly and bit his own wing. Come, child, quench your thirst, he said. So she drank the thick, dark blood and smiled with joy. Passing through the graveyard, menacing storm clouds loomed, and the air turned bitingly cold. The girl was shivering in her thin clothes. Oh, appeared, is that thing? And with a click of his fingers, crafted mist into a beautiful dress. Come, child, warm yourself, he coaxed. So she clothed herself and smiled with joy. Okay, now I'm getting some Harry Potter vibes. She went, the cloak. Hoping a boat she found would carry her so far, home. Two, two of the but hunger's grip tightened hollows. and her heart grew heavy. Then the fish king appeared and offered one of his many the third foods. Deathly Howl. Come child, eat your fill. So the girl ate and smiled with joy once more. Continuing on, she soon entered the forest dark. Okay, seeming like there's seeming like there's four then deathly in hollows a here. Beautiful golden gear. The creature said nothing as the girl approached and snatched what she thought was another gift. The horse grew angry oh. and summoned the other monsters. She up. She done did. Filled up. the girl's heart as the wild wind rose around the beasts. Suddenly, a witch appeared, dark, yet uh -oh. regal. That ain't what you like to see. All right. I'm curious how that story you plays into everything. But more you took, she snarled. So more in turn is due. In a blink, the girl was trapped inside a mirror. Right. We're not skipping this. This is, a, this is important. Said it was this juicy, juicy information. A local tale. Besides, Rose doesn't seem to mind. I don't know if I would. I don't know if I would tell my kid Thank a scary God. story like that. We moved here so that we got technical reload. My battery. Annoyed. It's not. Then, go cautiously take your daughter to bed. <laughs> she ain't taking none of his. I'll none of his. dinner. So she from the previous one. Did you say something? Nothing. I'll put her down. I think this game is quite dark. Oh no. Maybe it's supposed to be that way, so. Huh. Where do I live? Well, it just seems too dark. Alright, so they got the family pictures. They got everything around. They got a lot of pictures. 
We got a lot of pictures. Like, look at all this. Look at all these. Okay. Okay, Rose. There, there. Okay. It's like I said to your mom. That book's too scary for you. <laughs> Which way am I even Almost supposed there, to go? Honey. Where's the Where's our room? Is it here? Ah, yes. There it is. There's the kids' room. You can definitely tell because you know, toys here. Oh. Wait, I'm confused. No, I'm confused. Where do we keep the kid at? So th there's some tea going on. There's there's some drama already building up, and here is. Keep your mother waiting. Here it is. She's scary when she's angry. Don't you worry. I'll be right downstairs. Daddy won't let those weird fairy tales. I will say it's not the most scary, most scary thing. I don't know. Like I said, would you guys read your kid that story or no? All right. I just go say hi to my hi to my wife. What up, Shorty? What Is we she cooking? Okay? What we cooking? Sleeping today? like a well, like a baby. Hmm, <laughs> that smells good. What's that? Oh, hands off, Mister. Uh, did the soup wow, just go through the spoon? Full native, haven't you? <laughs> Did Local the soup wine just go too. through the spoon? What the? You're gonna keep sulking all evening. Maybe you shouldn't have any. <sighs> you really have to stop worrying. So I tell you, it's one of us is um, finding you in Louisiana. The pregnancy, Chris moving us here. Yeah, one of them is still stuck on it. The so other fast, one's trying to move you know? on from it. Well, at least we're all together. There. You, me, Rose. Now, everything's Something's gonna happen. Seriously. I think we can just forget Something's about what happen. happened in the week. What? <laughs> Duh. Louisiana? It happened so long ago. I just, I don't understand why you are so... <sighs> Mia, get down. What? Duh. Mia. Oh, God. Something tells me she's dead. <laughs> Something tells me she's dead. I don't think she's getting back up Chris? from that. What the hell? Sorry, Ethan. No! Well. What? If Why? she wasn't dead, she is now. Alright. Well, that just happened. Am I getting dragged out or am I walking on my own? Nope, getting dragged out. Cool. No, Rose! Someone save the kid! Rose? What the hell are you doing Rose with my daughter? Rose doesn't deserve this. Come on, man. Sir. Take him away. I said get your Come hands on, off Come on, man. Her. Ethan. No. Jeez. Sheesh. Man's down bad right now, let me tell you. Man's down bad. We start the game off. His wife gets shot multiple times. Like, something tells me that was a bit of an overkill. If you ask me. And then his, and then his, then his daughter gets stolen. Man's is down bad right now. No problem. We'll be there. She'll see us next week. How old is Rose? Hey now. Do we know yet? Think positively, all right? We talked about this. I know. We hardly talk about anything else. I keep telling you it's not Rose that I'm worried about. Well, then what are you worried about? Look, she's going to be fine. I just know it. What else matters? We matter, Ethan! You matter. matter. You just Mia. What are you, what are you talking, talking about? What is? Is there something you're not telling me? me? Come on, talk, talk to, me. to me. Damn it! I have to, I have take, to take this. this. I'm, I'm, I'm few. I am confusion. All right, so off to off to a hot start. Let me tell you, we already got um, one dead, one lost, one one. 
well, knocked out cold. We got a lot happening right now. We're gonna make it through. We're gonna have some fun. We're gonna get. We're gonna get scared. Is it work calling again? I don't even know what that's on. What's your status? Is the package safe? What are you talking about? Where's Chris Redfield and Rose? Who is this? This is a secure channel. You are not authorized to walk over. That's not his phone. Fuck. So we got knocked out cold and now we woke up to this. Okay. Um Why am I already scared? <laughs> I'm already kind of freaking out. I'm not gonna lie, chat. I said chat. Fuck. I'm already freaking out. Not gonna lie, guys. I can't even see two feet in front of me. Bro, this is like pitch black. Yeah, I can't I can't see anything, guys. Oh, I can hear that though. Am I even going the right way? I don't know. Um, some, uh, that hurt. Yeah, that does. Oh, oh, wait, I'm at, oh, here's the map. That might help. So yeah, just keep going straight. It looks like literally just keep going straight. Got it. How, how dumb are you, dude? Oh, that's, that's a lot of dead birds. Whoa. Okay. I got scared by a bird hanging on the. Why did I choose the place? Please, please save. Oh, what is that? What is that? Lord, baby Jesus, please save me. I, I'm sorry. I have sinned. Please, please help me. I am sorry. I don't deserve this. Hello, mother. I don't, need, I don't mean to be so alone and so scared. Somebody save me. A door? It's a door? I don't even know. I feel like I'm gonna see like a face there. Oh, there's the door. There's the door. Okay. I'm very scared for a jump scare right now. It's so dark. Oh. Okay. Every noise is just freaking me out right now, guys. I'm not even gonna. I'm not even gonna lie to you guys. <laughs> Can someone hold my hand? I don't want to go down there. I don't want to go down there, guys. All right. Uh, we're just gonna put that back. We don't need to look at that. Hello? Santa, that you? Santa Claus! Is that you? Did you come bearing gifts? I would like a present. <laughs> oh. Santa? You tell me that's just your reindeer that came in with you? What do I get for going into the basement? Like, who does that? Who goes into the basement of a scary cabin? Alright. Um... Well, there's blood there now. All right, you know what? Just, just don't even ask questions anymore. Did what did all this? Are you telling me I was in there from nighttime to daytime? Cause it's light out there now. It gets bright. There's no way. All right, let's keep it going. Made it through step one. We're in the we're in the daylight, so we're safe. We're safer. I shouldn't say safer. Safer. All right. What we got behind door number one? Where the hell am I? Of course, it's a creepy town with a big church in the center of it. Why wouldn't it be? Oh, wait. Don't forget the giant castle. All right. How do I get down there? Do I just do I just fall? Oh, that's right. Okay. Um, a real horse. 
Yeah. Yeah, that's his neck, isn't it? Okay. Maybe, maybe they're out. What the f can do something like this? Is there anything else for me doing here, or am I just kind of wandering in here for no reason? All right, let's get out. Did I just. Did I just see something move. You know, now I understand why people do that in scary movies. I saw something move, and my first reaction was go to it, like a dumb, dumb boy. I always wonder why people do that in scary movies, but now I understand.